So welcome back guys to the fourth day of the 2012 Olympics. Let's just have a quick look at the medal tally. And we've got Australia coming in first, closely followed by Switzerland. I guess all the other major countries are nowhere nearby. Oh, Great Britain has two, no, what do they have? A silver medal. Two points though. The US is nowhere to be seen, which is great because we don't want the US to be anywhere near us. So let's go ahead and go for something easy. Let's see, maybe the 10 meter platform, that's not going to be easy at all, so you guys can enjoy watching me fail at that. We'll be even lucky to even qualify for that, to be honest. And then let's do the men's 100 meters. Um, should be decent at the 100 meters, but the diving I am absolutely hopeless at. Also, my controller is going to die, so hopefully we'll be managed to get this episode out scot-free without any problems, but that is very, very doubtful. Yeah, here we go with the... Aquatic Center itself. This is the Aquatic Center, and this is the first event of the day. All right, man, I want to skip the tutorial, and I hate how this guy keeps on talking. Anyway, we've got Billy Tim Shimshaw. Very interesting name. But I'm not going to be choosing any of these easy dice, because even if you score, like, perfectly on them, the difficulty makes no difference, really. So let's go with the three and a half forward in pike. Here we go, then. Needs to just go for it here. Oh, beautiful. Responding to that. that was pretty much perfect, I think, I hope. He's happy. Here is the yes, yes, I don't want to say the replay, I want the scores. Nine, oh, perfect. Oh. See how the, judges rated it. the Australian gives us good scores, but that was decent, 78. Well, let's take a oh, first place, yes. and there's good news. I already did this a little bit before, place. and I had like scores of like 40. So that's why I'm choosing the really, so really hard athlete, dives. And the question is the now, three and a half. Can they oh. up their that's pretty scary. It must have good balance. I wonder what would happen like if we just kept on. I guess it is a game and then he'd just stay still. But in real life, I would probably fall back by. <laughs> All right. Oh. Well, this athlete's capable of an awful lot more than that. That dive Very wasn't really straight. It always amazes me how these divers can get the smallest little splashes well, when they dive the from so far down. But we did alright. Well, let's have another look at the scoreboard and third place after the latest round. That's a good performance. Well, all the other guys are getting higher and higher and we, we went lower, so... Not the best of starts. Well, things have been let's go ahead well, and maybe get. Very much in the mix. Let's see. And now comes the question. This thing. How much does this diver want it? It didn't seem that hard, so. Ooh. Well, that was a tough Ouch. third round. We're now midway through this competition, and this competitor still has plenty to do. Oh no, that was actually one of our that worst dives. We didn't go down in the water straight, which is our main problem. Well, another look at the scoreboard, and this is the impact that last dive has had. All right, at least we're still in fourth, and uh, there is a bit of a difference a between dive. fourth and third, so we have still a bit of space left. Difficulty. Let's go with the three and a half well, inward this tuck. Is an ambitious, bold, and brave choice. Can this athlete do it? Well, I'm Ouch. sure he'll feel he let himself it just it doesn't give us there. enough time to like In strand ourselves up to the execution which really sucks because I always enter the water on the on. side <laughs> which would hurt back like backflops was missing some crucial elements and that will be reflected on the score still fourth though that's all that matters as long as we get into the finals let's what go ahead with the three and a half oh wow this is gonna be How difficult and we've got to run up point. as well though oh no we missed it. No. Ouch! Definitely not the most memorable <laughs> dive you're ever going to see by any no. stretch of the imagination. Definitely not memorable. Those are pretty shocking scores. Incorrect dive. You lose points on difficulty, and that will cost Ouch. the diver on the scoreboard. Only seven and a half score. Wow. All right. Well, we're gonna have to get what? Gonna have to beat the guy that's coming in fourth by about twenty points now. Wow, that was shocking. All right. Need to shoot high with this selection. Well, let's go with the three-arm forward, one twist in tuck, which just well, sounds brave. wow. Really brave it sounds and looks pretty crazy, but we have to score pretty well on this. Oh, oh dear! Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. 
Well, let's have a look at the replay. Not enough elevation. No, nope. not, not going to do that well. So oh, well. Actually, I'm rather happy that we didn't actually qualify. The points. diving takes a bit too long. I had I have to say myself. So I don't like the episodes that to run for too long, especially like boring ones. Like the shooting was rather boring. I'd have to say. Like you've seen it once. You've seen it all, pretty much. Anyway, we what do we have now? So, oh, the 100 meter race. This is like the most important thing ever. Welcome to this magnificent stadium for the qualifying rounds of the 100 meters. This event over in the blink of an eye, but the spectators have been waiting all day. No, we best be hoping our controller doesn't die because that would be <laughs> really awkward. 100 meters, a good start, crucial to success in this event. Away from the oh no, pretty shocking start. Underway. Using his strength and stamina here. No time Come on, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes! <laughs> first place. Oh yeah. At least we get to go through to the final. In first place as well. Great start. Poland going to the finals as well. Since when did they have good sprinters? And China as well. And Kenya. Kenya's made basically known for their like long distance runners. Which is interesting because like Black people usually have like higher calf implants, which makes them like they insert their calf insertions are a lot higher, which means that they can run a lot faster, uh, sprint a lot faster, and then white people have lower calf insertions, which technically would mean that they can run long distances faster. But it doesn't really work out like that in the Olympics. It's always black people winning everything. All right, brilliant start. Through 50, this is really close. No, no, get at least get a medal. No, oh, that was pretty shocking. Bastard, Poland beat me. Gotta make do with one of the minor placings, and although we like knowledge, the crowd far less than he expected. As we damn right, it's less than I expected. All smiles, it's so disappointing. Second place, a silver medal. Oh wow, where did Great well, Britain really come out from? Terrific competition in the discus. Really some great performances. That's all for now from the Olympic Stadium from Seth Bennett. We'll see you next time. So I didn't get anything that day. What a waste of a day that was. That makes me very, very upset. Anyway, so now we're equal with Great Britain. Great Britain is probably going to win, but Let's have a, oh yes, we're definitely doing javelin, definitely good at that, and maybe the men's 50 meter, free, 50 meter freestyle. We've got long jump and triple jump, which we'll probably do tomorrow, like the next day, at least the next episode, because we do it two days now, an episode, which you guys wanted to see, long episode, so we'll be doing that. Hopefully everything will render out right, so I think last episode the audio wasn't exactly in sync with the gameplay. Which is unfortunate. I've got to try to make. I'd like. I thought it was good when I was rendering it out, but obviously it wasn't. I didn't really notice it when I once I already rendered the video, so I sort of missed that. Here we go, with Alan Bender. So many athletes clustered together. This is going to be really close. Only those at their peak will go through. All right, so here we got to go for an angle of 35. Oh, and that. Oh, come on. That was actually a really good throw. Look at that. And this looks oh, come on. Won't trouble the leaderboard with that. that was pretty much perfect. Anyway, it will come first anyway, so I'm not really too fast. Well, here we are in the second round. We're basically guaranteed a gold medal, and if I don't get a gold medal, I will be very upset. Come on, that's perfect. Oh, you... Oh, Got to try to contain myself. Oh, that's a bit further up, but that was close. Well, Alright, let's just be a bit conservative out, now and, be a foul. and actually just qualify Here we go, then. in first, number of three. course. That's good run up. Alright, that's good. Yeah, that's pretty much perfect. We'll qualify easy. Look at that. Good performance. And that was me being pretty conservative. We're really close to the world record. And I think Australia I have the world record itself. Should be no nerves now in round number four. Alrighty. Oh, that was way too high. And we'll still be coming, like, that throw will still beat everyone. All our opponents. Let's see, 83.26. Well, 
83.26 was still beating everyone. So the javelin's like a lot easier than like pretty much everything else. Perfect. Well, that's a foul. Oh man, that was such a good throw. He's even celebrating. If only you could see your throw, like, even if it was a foul, how far would that would have went? That, that was pretty much perfect. Last chance saloon, six. Right, perfect power. Let's go for perfection now. Oh, good angle. Two degrees off. That's probably going to... Is it going to beat out? Ooh. It didn't beat out previous throw. 20 centimeters off, but... Guaranteed first place, I guess, in the gold medals. But we got our 50 meter freestyle as well. Which I also might have the world record for as well. I'm rather good at that. Because, like, you don't need to time yourself too much. It's only, like, for the 50 meters as well. And mo half the race in the 50 meters is basically a dive. That's the most important thing in the 50 meters. As long as you're doing well in that, you'll do well in the race. Well, plenty of crowd support here. They're all ready to get this event underway. Start crucial. They're off. All right, had a decent start. Fourth, third, second. Really good stroking. Australia are in first place. Second, great. We got it. We got it. Italy are in third place. Oh no! Don't slow. Oh, we're slowing down there for a second. But we did qualify comfortably as the commentator said. So we should have a good, easy two golds this day. This is actually rather good. Hopefully, we'll actually, well, we will be beating Great Britain now by two golds. Because we're even, even Stevens right now. There's only two events on this day. I think it's the fifth or sixth day already. I think it's the fifth day, sorry, because we did one day on the first episode and then two days last episode and two days today should be the fifth day lead will take the next step on their Olympic dream perfect run up oh perfect look at that if only we could have run up a little faster but boy boy that was pretty good that was really good guaranteed gold medal guaranteed gold medal Second attempt. I'll just keep on running. I just want to not actually throw it. I want to see what will happen. <laughs> it runs up quite a lot. Okay, I don't really think we need that camera angle just for proof. Well, but okay. And what the hell is up with all these photographers? They should not be allowed doing that to be doing that. It's crazy, right? This is actually run up really slow. Perfect speed. Look at that. <laughs> I love how the well, guys that measure are automatically like within walking distance of the javelin itself. But all right, let's try to get our world record. Oh, that's pretty shocking. All right, so we can keep on going really slow. Pull it up right now. Yeah, pull, pull, and throw. Oh yeah. Nowhere near this athlete's best. I think just slightly out of reach. All right, now let's go for the world record. That was a really good run up. That was a pretty shocking throw though. And a bit too early as well. That will still land us in first place though. At what, like 87.45? Still should be first place. Yo, just by a bit though, that would have been first place. But guaranteed gold medal here. And that's a pretty shocking run up. Sixth and final round then for this athlete. That's a foul. Just over. Oh wow, that was perfect. Oh wow. That's over 90 meters. And I've got to be honest, the high jumpers are starting to get So here we go with the gold medal, and many of you guys told me to sing along with the national anthem, but it cuts off halfway through. So unfortunately I will not sing. Sorry to disappoint. But we'll definitely won't be quitting the national anthem. We want to listen to it. The flags fly high. As now we'll pause for a moment to reflect on a terrific performance.
the flags of success fly high over the Beauty, stadium. sorry to disappoint with the singing thing, but you know, and these moments you gotta really do what you gotta do. I have the, co the this commentator has got to shut up. He just keeps on talking while the national anthem is playing. What the hell is up with that? I think that because especially because these guys that made this were, were Australian. They let the commentator talk over the Australian national anthem. It'd be alright if it was any other national anthem, but the Australian one? This is the Come on. Event of this session at the Aquatic Centre here in Stratford. The athletes are ready. 17,500 fans are ready. Oh god, and here we go with the uh, foul controller. I think hopefully we'll have a, a last Let's little bit of battery life left just to last us the race. Some cool customers out there. Or Everyone's shocking the start. Oh, that's actually first place, really. Of the 50 meters free start. Powerfully built. Really strong stroker. In first place, Australia. Second, Canada. In third, it's Italy. Oh, yes. Look at that. Beautiful. Goal. Two goals. Australia. And we actually beat our other time that we got in the qualifiers as well. Which is a rather good race, but we even beat that just then. So, we get to listen to the Australian National Anthem in the pools this time. Greece came second in Italy. Two shocking economies right there. is rocking and quite rightly so. indeed it is and those people the were whistling during the Australian National Anthem what the hell is up with that but two golds for that day that made up for the shocking day yesterday and there we go we have retry tokens now which are very very important but with that being said we are almost doubling Great Britain in the medal tally with uh, 14 points they've got eight Switzerland still on seven so we've done really well for ourselves in the last couple of days. Let's just check the next events. We've got shooting volleyball. So, excuse me, we'll just be doing a volleyball next and let's see. Hmm. I don't know, I don't want to promise anything yet, but we'll be definitely doing volleyball and I don't know, we'll have to wait and see, but we'll be doing something or, well, we'll definitely be doing two events and we'll do something after that as well. So guys, make sure you come back for the next episode, which should be uploaded very soon after this one.